Hi, I'm Tom from Waterwise Botanicals. You know, let's talk about bushes, shrubs, stupid bushes. In the landscape, we've been accustomed over a lot of decades to having some just bushes in the landscape. And a lot of these need to be in the size and shape of a plant that gets to be maybe a couple of feet high and maybe two or three feet wide. We want kind of that perfect low dome shaped kind of a bush in the landscape that fills spots where we need some medium height and space. And traditionally in the industry, there's been the varieties of plants like uh, Indian hawthorns and the mock oranges. And they have some varieties that have been uh, selected to kind of be in that slot of that size range and everything. And so hundreds of thousands, if not millions of them, are planted all over in people's homes, shopping centers, you know, just landscapes along streets and that kind of thing. And they're used everywhere. And we're accustomed to them. But things are changing, aren't they? We have a situation now where we've been coping with an extended drought. We have a situation where maintenance is becoming harder and more expensive. And so we're looking for alternatives. What's a great alternative for some of the traditional shrubs and bushes that we've been using in the landscape? Believe it or not, there's a succulent that can fill that niche. And when I say succulent, a lot of times people go, I don't know, because it creates a picture immediately in their mind of some hard leathery looking jade plant, or maybe an agave, you know, the century plant, and it looks kind of deserty and stickery. But you know what? Here at Waterwise Botanicals, we're looking for plants that actually don't have that succulent look because people are, want to have something that they've been accustomed to for some time. And so today I want to talk to you about a plant called Ripple Jade. Ripple Jade, that's right. And you'll find out why we call it that in just a minute. But the botanical name on it is Crassula arborescens undulatifolium Ripple Jade. And this plant is really cool because first of all, it's got this beautiful limey color. And you can already see that it fits that size niche that we were just talking about. This is a beautiful shrub. This is actually about two, two and a half years old. And it's a combination of three plants that were spaced about three feet apart and planted in a five gallon sized plant. And you see that in about two years or so that it's filled in and kind of looks like one single shrub. But this is a mature plant so you can get a sense of its size. Okay, And it, it even has white starry flowers on it in late winter and early spring. So it's got a little bit of the flower thing going on also. Now some succulents are actually sensitive to too much love. You try to water them in the summertime when it's really hot and sometimes they're actually trying to be dormant during that time of year so they rot and die underneath. And that can be a problem. Well this particular plant is so versatile that it'll take any conditions. It can be grown in a situation where it's quite dry. It can also be grown in regular garden watering. And either way, it's completely happy. And where can you plant it? You can plant it in full sun, or you can plant it even in pretty substantial part shade, and it still performs beautifully. Now, it is in the jade plant family, although it doesn't look like a jade plant at all. And the jade plant family sometimes is sensitive to freeze and frost damage. This particular plant is hardy to the mid 20s, and it'll also take heat well into the 100 plus. But probably the coolest feature about ripple jade is its texture. You know, when people see it, they just come up and they see all these twisty leaves, and you just want to reach in and kind of tousel its hair. I mean, this thing is cute. You just want to hug it and squeeze it because it's got this neat, twisty, kind of windswept, like looks like it's been running and playing texture to its leaves and that's why we call it the Ripple Jade. Crassula arborescens undulatifolium Ripple Jade, a fantastic new introduction into landscaping outdoors with succulents. I'm Tom Jesh for Waterwise Botanicals, and that's waterwisebotanicals.com.